Crosstown rivals Becca and Freedom faced off at Joseph J. McIntyre Gymnasium, a showdown between a couple of youthful up-and-coming squads. Of the 12 starters last evening, seven were underclassmen, including two sophomores and a couple of freshmen for the visitors. And those youngsters would have quite the impact for Gabby Minio's Golden Hawks, who are coming off back-to-back -back wins after opening the season with setbacks against some of the league's elite, Easton, Liberty, and Parkland. Lori Gooman's Patriots, meanwhile, won two of three matches a week ago in moving their early season record to three and two. It was all Becca, though, in set one. The Golden Hawks with a handful of aces in the opening game. Two each from junior Leah Bender and sophomore Teresa Rule. Visitors also with four blocks in the opener. This denial by freshman Jocelyn Bell made it 23-8. Becca en route to the 25-9 set one victory. Game two, a much tighter affair. Five ties and a couple of lead changes. Sophomore Sophia Bedix drawing it even at four apiece early before this kill from Freedom's, so Freedom's sophomore setter Sarah Kokolis pushed the Pates out to a 10-8 advantage. The final tie came at 11 all, but from there, the Hawks rattled off seven straight points to seize control. Bender with one of her six kills on the night during that run before Bedix landed her third kill of the set to put away point in Becca's 25-18 game to triumph. Golden Hawks up two sets to none, and they put this one away in the third, thanks in large part to their fabulous freshman outside hitter, Jocelyn Bell, who counted seven of her match-high 12 kills in game three. She landed three straight points in pushing Becca's lead to seven at 18-11 before converting the clincher as Bethlehem Catholic outlasted Freedom 25-19 in the third in taking the match three sets to none. After some early season struggles against established programs, this youthful bunch of birds has now rattled off three straight wins, all via three-set sweeps. It feels really good. It makes me feel really confident, like, going back to those games that started off the season with a lot more, like, hope and... It's making me feel really good. Today, just the hustle and communication. Every ball there going for a full effort. We played with an urgency today, which was our key thing the past few weeks, so really just having an urgency for every single ball we're going for. In the beginning of the season, since we're also like so new to the team and even new to high school since we're so young, it took us a while to like actually come together and bond. But I think like as the season's been moving on, our talking has gotten so much better and the energy on the court. So definitely talking to each other really helped us win. I think because they're so young still, but they have so much potential, so there's still so much room to grow. So to see the level that we're playing at right now with the age they're at is just super exciting to see where they're going to be in a few years, a few weeks, and a few months from now.